So the other thing we got to look at is a midpoint. All right. Now, a midpoint causes way less problems than bisector. All right. Because a midpoint, it's a point. It pretty much is only ever really on a segment. Um, it gets confused a lot less. Doesn't mean it never gets confused. So it's in the center of a line segment. All right. And it breaks that segment into two equal parts. So again, we have two equal parts. A lot of geometry is knowing that things are equal. They add to 180, different things like that. But equal and add, a, add to 180 are the two most common ones. All right. Remember, only a segment can have a midpoint. An angle cannot have a midpoint. All right. So you never look at an angle and go, oh, that's the midpoint. It makes two equal parts. That's There's no such thing. All right. Pay close attention to the segment with the midpoint so you can find the correct parts. That goes with all of this stuff. All right. A lot of the problem in the first unit of the year every year is that everyone's just not paying close enough attention to things. We're understanding it at the very minimal level and then just kind of haphazardly applying it to whatever we see as best we can. So if you scroll down here, it's got a quick picture of a midpoint. All right. But I'm more interested in this right here. It says if D is the midpoint of HC, what are the equal parts? All right. Well, let's make sure we know where HC is. Go from H over to C. All right. And you don't need necessarily have to highlight that, but... While I'm practicing, I think it's a pretty good idea that I do. All right, what are the two parts of that? Well, the two parts are that half right there and that half right there. All right, DC is the green part, HD is the blue part. We would know that those two are equal. All right, and again, remember, really pay attention to what the um, segment with the midpoint is because if it wasn't HC, then those would not be the equal parts. So it's very, very important, especially with more complicated diagrams, to really zone in on that so that we're making sure that we get uh, the proper information.